Talk to Eagle Flies. Yep. Ready to get this over with. You're done for. So good of you to join us. What's going on? Rebellion. The smell of...
cordite and integrity. It is a beautiful thing. What are y'all doing? An eye for an eye. We didn't start this, Arthur. They did. We? This ain't our fight. It surely is. Whatever it is you're planning, it ain't a good idea. They want you to fight. Nobody will be killed. We're just gonna trap a few of them in the valley, disarm them, tar and feather them, and remind them to leave these boys alone. You have energy for pranks? Come on, Arthur. Just tweaking Uncle Sam's nose a little. I need you to help me. Besides, it's perfect. People will see these boys, they won't notice us, and they'll think we're gone. Everyone will blame everything on the Indian problem, and we'll disappear up the river. But first, we need to trap them in this pass. Help me dynamite up these trees. So, you're using them? No, sir. No. Never. What? It is mutually beneficial to draw attention to one problem and avail over another. These are good people, but their situation is real complex. We ain't helping them. Sure we are. Come on, let's get this done. I'll plant the dynamite, you run the wire. We'll keep the lookout from up here. I sent for some of that dynamite. You and Bill commandeered in Van Horn. Good work with that, by the way. Bill played drunk. The perfect man for the job. Finally got to see Colm hang. Yeah. After all those years, hard to believe. Oh, but it was worth the wait. See? We're tying up the loose ends, Arthur. One by one. Okay, let's go, Arthur. Hurry, I think I see some movement in the distance. Quick now, Arthur. Everyone into position! My spotter will let us know when they're near. They're coming now. Ah, oh, damn. Patrol's a lot larger than we thought it was gonna be. <laughs> Don't worry. That's a good thing. Okay, that's the signal. Here they come. Stay low and quiet. You sure you don't want me to man that plunger, Arthur? No. I got it. Oh, remove the weight of the world from your shoulders for a minute. Like I said, we're just going to give them a bit of a scare. There they are. Looks like more than we thought. It's fine. We're only here to talk and administer a little good old-fashioned humiliation. You're owed that, son, at the very least. Wait for my lead, men. Everyone just stay calm. We've got the upper hand here. Okay. They've... Put your hands up. You're surrounded. Nobody need get hurt. 
Your humiliation of us has gone on quite enough. This ain't a good idea. Put down your guns. You are making a mistake, boy. No. You're making a mistake. Put your hands up, soldier. Take a little humiliation and leave these fine folks alone. Who are you? A concerned citizen. Is that so? What now? We should move. No, 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 not quite yet. Soldier, you and your friends gonna tuck tail and run off? Run! Excuse me? I'm getting bored of this. Your friends fired first, soldier! Mathana won't be happy about this. They fired first. There's another patrol in the rear. Looks like we got a fight then, boy. Fools, it's the army. It is one regiment of pastry chefs and bullies. Watch your goddamn mouth. All of you, take what you can, and then we move out. Move now. We have to move now. Search these men quickly, then we move. This is crazy. Why aren't we getting out of here? They might have information on them that'll help our friends with their cause. Find anything? Yes. Some poor fool from New Jersey. These boys ain't the problem. They're only kids. Keep looking. Peter. Damn. 
They're sending riders from the fort. We need to leave. But where's Peta? Was he killed? He's alive. Well, that went just about according to plan. I'm trying. I'm trying, Arthur, with everything I have, and I will keep trying, and you'll keep doubting me, and we'll keep failing. It ain't like that, Dutch. Look at me. Look at me! I'm just... I'm worried about folk. I know. I... We should go. Where's Eagle Flash? Run, son! Run! Come on! This area is gonna be crawling with soldiers in a few minutes. We gotta leave. Now! What about Eagle Flash? We gotta go, Arthur. Come on! We need to ride hard. Stay with me. here. We won't get the horses down this path. All right. Let's carry on by foot. Try and sell them a little snake oil. You think? It's all I got. Get out of here. Gah! Let's see if we can lose them down here. Go to hell. Yeah. I guess not. Get behind something. Well, Arthur. Put your hands up! I say put your damn hands up! Okay! Okay! Follow my lead. I got a plan. This is a good one. Hello! Officers! You keep them hands up and come here. Put your hands up! Hello, Captain. Keep your hands up and come here. Come here. We, uh, we can't do that. Your man, those men they killed, they were good men. You're fighting nature, Captain. Get over here. Ask my friend here. My whole life, I tried to fight change. It's a waste. I see that. Now, it's a waste. 
You can't fight nature, Captain. You can't fight change. You can't fight. is what we need. Oh, we just escaped from chaos. Eagle flies must have been taken. Taken or killed. Well, we can't go find out. No, not now. Charles, I'll, we'll send them. Uh, where is it? <coughs> He's probably back at camp. Let's split up. I'll go tell him. You rest up. Keep a lookout. We are gonna make it, brother. I can feel it. Faith, Arthur. Have faith. Let's go help Albert. We haven't seen him in a Here. Whoa, whoa! It's okay, girl. Hey, friend. Get lost. <laughs> oh, I've been scratching the gravel today. Hey, let me see that ugly mug. Careful. Almost shut it. Ever see a man die? I'm your... talking. I'm put you on the ground. Son of a... Ah! What you want? Yeah. <laughs> Ain't so full of yourself, huh? Yeah. 
TV. Tell the law all about you. And if they ever come out here. Where's the sport in shooting someone in a cage? <laughs> I arrive with Colum Driscoll.
Is it an Easter? We're fine. <laughs> fine. Hello again. Hello. Oh, hello. How are you, sir? Uh, Morgan, Mr. Morgan. I'm sorry, my, my nerves. I'm not quite the outdoor adventurer I thought. This is God's own country, and I feel I'm in purgatory. I know the feeling. No, I hope not. So what you trying to take some pictures of, huh? Some more greedy coyotes? No. Wolves. Wolves? Now you really are trying to get yourself eaten. Oh, I hope not. I left the meat over there. I thought I'd be safe. Given the wind. Yeah, sure. If you managed to attract the world's least intelligent wolf. Well, I... I... I'll stay with you a while. If anything comes, I'll protect you as needed. You are a gentleman. Now, you don't know me very well. Uh, to me, you're a gentleman. Really? I'm worse than the wolves. You had many dealings with wolves, Mr. Morgan? Sure. But you've never been eaten. Not through lack of trying on their part. A while back, I helped a friend from getting devoured. Usually, they are not great fans of man. Me neither. Hey, shh. Here's one. Looks like we got company. Yes, yes, there they are. In the trees. Now, don't do anything. I'm going to take a few photographs. Come on. Come on. Good boys. Hungry boys. Come on. Stay back. Stay back. Can't have a man in the frame. They think it's staged. Yeah, sort of is. Yeah. Magnificent creatures. Clawing at your eyeballs. You provoked them, Mr. Morgan. They ain't provoked. They ain't provoked. Do something, Mr. Morgan. Hey, back up. Stay back. Is that all of them? We might have kept the wolves from the door. My whole futile existence flashed before my eyes. Yeah, they can be pretty aggressive. What a way to literally a dog's dinner. Still worse things happen at sea. Do they? <laughs> well, I imagine. Perhaps wolves do better at sea. Are they good swimmers? Well, who knows? You have saved my poor foolish skin once again. Don't mention it. Well, I can't begin to repay my debt of gratitude. But no, I am eternally in your debt. I do, Mr. Mason, I do. You take care now. And you too, sir.
It's me, Arthur. Good to see you back, Arthur. And scene. Go to hell. You know, Jack, Dutch thought your pa was gold once too, till he realized he was just yelling. Leave my son the hell alone. You got something to say? Say it to me, you son of a bitch. Cherish every last moment with him, John. <laughs> oh, look, the rest of the old guard. <laughs> What? <laughs> Are you all right, Morgan? You seem very... tense. Shut up. Okay. Guess I'll see you later, then. Whatever, Black Lung. What a dick. Could really use some more meat, Mr. Morgan. Many thanks, Mr. Morgan. Mrs. Adler, you okay? Peach. You sure? No, I ain't sure. You still working? Is anybody still working? The whole goddamn place full of people bickering, fighting, and lying. It makes me real sad. I know. I need someone to ride with me. Do what? Finish off them of Driscoll's. I hear the last of them is holed up at Hanging Dog Ranch. Saw Colm swing. I, I just don't care. I was a married woman. You know what they did to me and to my husband. Like you're the only one of these fools that I trust. I've got to do this. I'll tell you what. I'll do it. But there's something you could help me with. Abigail, Jack, John, make sure they make it. I mean, this whole thing is pretty much done. But when the time comes... Or how do you mean? When the time comes, you help them. What do you mean? I mean, help them escape when I... You know, you and me, we're more ghosts than people, but them... They, they could... I know. Of course I will. Thank you, Arthur. You want to ride with me now, or meet me up at Hanging Dog Ranch when you can? <whistles> Thanks, Arthur. Okay. Come on. <clears throat> I think you that out. Hey. Hey. What's going on? I think there's a bunch of them in there, mostly drunk. One of them is a fat fella with a beard. Him? He's mine. Sure. How are we doing this? We're just going in. 
<clears throat> okay, then. It's a big ranch, run down, lots of folk there, but spread pretty thin. I'll set it off and then we'll, we'll take it from there. Take it from there? Okay, so no real plan then. Oh, I got a plan. Now come on. Wait, she's from Dutch's gang. It's over now! 
You okay? Yeah. He was a good man, my Jakey. We was always sweet on one another. I'm sure. Yeah. I miss him every day, every moment. Oh, they turned me into a monster, Arthur. But my memories of him, they still pure. I ain't even got that. Aside from my Jake, you're the best man I've known. I know the company you keep. The competition ain't too fierce. <laughs> we, uh, we should get away from her. Yeah. I think I need to be alone for a bit. I understand. You, uh, I want to get yourself cleaned up. Thank you, Arthur. Just leave what you got in the cellar and be on your way. My guts give me hell, and I ain't in a sociable mood. Which one are you again? Walker? Wheeler? I don't know. All you boys look the same these days. Hey! What's taking so long down there? Poking around and get back up here. What the hell you think you're doing? You put that back, or we will hunt you down. Now that's the worst mistake you could ever make. You think you can steal it from me is the worst mistake you ever made.
Skin you alive when I tell them what you done. You wait till my boys get their hands on you. Okay, girl. Okay, that'll do it for this episode. If you liked it, hit that like button and subscribe. As always, I've been Super Video Gamer, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye bye!